Hey guys, welcome back to another Twinfinite Gamers video, and in this video we are back again in our Terraria world. These Terraria videos seem to be really, really popular. Like, they're getting like 20 views. So, um, I did do a little off-camera stuff. I made another chest because my storage was getting really full. Um, I realized why my armor, like, when it craft, and it's because I was trying to use the crafting table when I was supposed to use the anvil, so let's see here. Yeah, now I can craft armor. I think I'm just gonna create boots, because wooden boots don't have any protection, and these boots do. So that's all I'm gonna do for now. I also want to craft some iron in the furnace, because I have, like, so much iron ore. So I got 26 bars now. Uh, iron chain mail. That has three defense. Well, this thing only has one. I, I, I'm strong now. Can I, do I still have enough to afford a pickaxe? No, I spent all my iron. I only have two bars left. No. I, 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 I just want to craft a pickaxe and I craft armor instead. How could I? But that's not the point of this video to, um, worry about not being able to craft stuff. I was actually exploring a little off camera because, um, Remember last video when I said that I wanted to find a jungle and then I couldn't find one and I'd say I'd s and I and I said I'd save it for another episode. Well, today is that episode. So I was exploring this. I actually lit it up with torches because I was trying to go there at night and then I died three times. <laughs> so I lit it up. Um, so I could see everything around and so that if I ever come here at night again, you guys can actually see anything and I won't die very easily. But this torch trail leads all the way to a jungle biome and it also comes cr across a desert and I actually want to explore one of these on camera. I didn't do it off camera because why would I do that? And um, for my last video, if you guys seen that, if you haven't seen that then you should go and see that right now. The camera was a little laggy and I figured out that's because um, when my camera was trying to process all those little particles from the clouds, um, it couldn't and then it lagged. So I'm going to try not to do that this episode. And also I f realize that if I don't have torches, um, you can't be or barely see anything. So I'm going to also be try to be good about placing torches and place a little more than usual. Also, I realized in my first episode, I called it a portal to the underworld, and it's not a portal. It is, um, passageway. It's nowhere close to a portal. Oh, wait, why am I taking damage? Why am I taking damage? Oh, oh. So, um, I just wanted to clear that up. And in my second video, I was trying to use a crafting table to, um, uh, make armor, and that wasn't what I was supposed to be doing either, so... <laughs> Yeah, hopefully I don't do anything like that in this episode. Also, I was watching one of my cousin's videos, and he made cactus armor, so I'm going to take some of this cactus and see what I can do with it. Maybe I can make a cactus pickaxe. So, as you guys know from the title of this video, this goal is to make an epic underground tree base, and um, I'll tell you what that means shortly. And I also want to use jungle wood, the wood from the jungle stuff, so that's why I want to go to the jungle. Alrighty, we have made it to the jungle. I found it! I found it! Yes, let's go! Oh, wait a minute. This is made out of normal wood? I came all the way here because I wanted normal wood when I could just... <sighs> what am I thinking? <laughs> Mercer the Traveling Merchant has arrived. Okay, so traveling merchants don't live in your house, so I think I'm just gonna head back before he, um leaves but first i want to explore under here wait i don't have any inventory left so maybe it is a good idea for me to just go home the only problem is this place is like so far away from home you have like no idea how far i was traveling i was traveling all night to get here Alrighty, we have finally made it back to base and for some reason my traveling merchant is on my roof but he doesn't really have anything i want i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna try to make a cactus helmet also, I can craft an iron pickaxe, and it's better than my, um, cactus pickaxe, so goodbye, pack cactus pickaxe. Uh, a cactus helmet is just as good as a wood helmet, but I'll take it because I like cactus helmet. Yeah, I look a lot cooler now. Also, um, in my last episode, I think I left my wood in that unbreakable chest that I might be able to break with this iron pickaxe now. So I'm going to head back up, but I'm not going to show it because I think my footage gets really laggy in these clouds. 
Well, it turns out I had actually gotten that wood, so... And it, the chest is still unbreakable for some weird reason. I don't know why I could break the other one. But it is now time to get to work on my epic tree base. Alrighty, here's how the build is looking so far. I'm gonna clean it up a little bit, and then it'll look so much nicer. And... Boom. There we go. Um, that took, like... A split second oh, for it for you guys but um so now I said this was gonna be an underground tree base and all you can see is well I mean it's supposed to be a tree it's gonna go higher than that eventually but um now for now I'm gonna start working on the underground part all right so I have a huge thing that leads pretty far down in the ground it's gonna go way farther so I'm gonna have rooms on either side of these I don't know how I'm gonna get rid of this water but um they're gonna those rooms are gonna be like storage rooms my rooms still hold valuables you know all that kind of stuff but now I want to finish work on this tree all right there's the top of the tree done and um I think the only way for me to get be able to get the leaves for this thing is if I go to that jungle place and get a bunch of leaves. So, um, I'm gonna head over there real quick and see if I can actually mine up those leaves. Alright, I finally found them, and can I mine it? It doesn't look like I can. Um, maybe if I use my axe. Am I collecting it? Oh, this was such a huge waste of time. How do I collect these stuff? Oh, I'm so mad right now. There has to be a way to collect it. I'll find a way to collect these things. But I want to explore the underground part of this too. So far there's been nothing very valuable. Ooh, a golden chest. A golden chest. I've never seen this before. Oh wow, if I use this mirror I can return home. That's nice. Except I spent all the time getting over there and now I'm back home. Wait a minute, I can make cactus chest. Oh, I need iron to make chests. That's why I couldn't make chests before oh okay alrighty the chest room is expanding well I guess until I can figure out how to add leaves I'm going to complete this um, underground place um guys I think I'm gonna stop the thing right about here because um, I'm running into that minecart cave thing and that not good so here is our thing it's i might make it lower maybe i don't know but for now it's this is gonna be good for holding all my rooms so um i'm gonna mine out my storage room right here all right so here's my storage room i put this um little wood platform right here so i can store chests up here as well as down here so i can have like double space i think i'm gonna make the ceiling a little taller because it's cramped in here all right and there is the storage room um i expanded it and then i made it a cramped again but now i can hold another row of chests so that's good i guess and so there's the storage room and now i'm gonna make the crafting room and here is the crafting room i'm actually gonna have to move in my chest to the chest room i just realized why i wasn't able to destroy that chest on the cloud and it's because you can't um destroy chests that have blocks inside of them for some reason there's the final chest and boom we are done as soon as i get these things out of my inventory all right now we're finally done with this chest room actually it's kind of annoying me that that chest is by itself alone so i'm gonna have to mine out this entire place so that i can place another chest on the same row and now we are done with the chest room but we still have this crafting room and then we're probably going to make more rooms and i'm grinding so hard on this video it's driving me nuts so this crafting room is not only going to have the crafting table it's also going to be having the furnace and the anvil and um, it's going to have room to store anything else I find out that I can craft with. But right now I only know about the crafting table, furnace, and anvil. We're going to smack the crafting bench right here, furnace right there, and the iron anvil right here. There we go. That's, that's the crafting room complete. There has to be more to craft than this. Craft with, I should say. Next up will be my... my... What else do I need? This will be my cactus room, how about that? Because I have a lot of cactuses, and I really want to make a room with cac cactus. Um, running out of ideas, guys. 
And here is the cactus room complete. Now I just need cactuses and sand and it should be done. So the cactus room will have a huge, giant cactus sculpture. There we go. Probably the worst cactus statue ever, but I like it because I made it. But since I couldn't put, make leaves on this tree because I have no idea why, I'll have to make it up to you guys. And to do that, I'm going to find another cloud, and it has to be a treasure cloud. If it's not a treasure cloud, then I will keep looking. Except I don't have any building blocks, so I'm going back to my chest room. I've been searching for a cloud for about two terraria days, so about 30, 40 minutes, I don't know. Sometime around that, and I could not find a single cloud. So, I've used up, like, all my building blocks, all 700 of that dirt, all my wood, even more wood that I chopped down trees from. I can't find a single cloud, guys. So, um, so instead of finding a cloud, we are going to be exploring the underground desert until we can find a life crystal. Guys, I've died so many times in that, um, cave, so, um, yeah, I have, I can't explore because I keep dying because the underground desert isn't, like, isn't, like, for people who just pl started, so, yeah, um, I can't do that, so, instead, with all my cactus, I'm gonna make a giant cactus statue outside my base, and we are done done here is the giant cactus statue if you're wondering yes i had to go back and grab more cactuses but the cactus statue is finally done i had to make these little pillars so i could actually get up and across it but it's okay because it's a really cool statue all right so um now we have to deal with the fact that um this thing does not look like a tree I know it doesn't have leaves, and that's probably what makes it not look like a tree, but, like, I want it to be taller than this, and I think the little slope does not look really good. I also realized that I didn't actually make a living room to my house, and I had claimed all that stuff from clouds to make it, so we're gonna have to work on that, too. Alright, it took all night, but I finally finished destroying this whole thing. Alrighty, and this is our massive tree base now complete. Look just look at the sheer size of this thing i spent so long on this and <laughs> now that we finally finished this um i'm actually gonna want to put platforms all over it so let me craft a few of those my plan is to put platforms like this so i can have like rooms ab in the tree and not just below the tree and i think that would look really really cool so i'm gonna do it Alright, now I have a platform system that leads all the way to the very top of the tree. Now I have to light it up so you guys can see it in the dark. And so, about a hundred torches later, we have finished lighting up the entire house. And now it's time to get to work on the living quarters. Alrighty, here's the room the living quarters will be in. Also guys, we are three subscribers away from... 30 subscribers so if you like this video and you enjoy what you see please hit the subscribe button alrighty so we have our sun plate blocks over here we have the door and we have the chairs and if you guys think we're done well we're not actually I forgot to put these chests down but if you guys think we're done we're not done we still have to do the whole wall and I really hope um 268 is enough so let's put my hopes into action Turns out I can't actually mine this dirt wall, and there's no point in me actually getting all those wall pieces, but I can make Skyware platforms, and I think it looks a whole lot cooler than normal platforms, and I don't know anyone of anyone who would disagree with me, so I'm going to be replacing these things. And I would replace these platforms, but there are way too many of them, and it's supposed to be a tree, so I want tree platforms. So yeah, and once I figure out how to make leaves, I'm going to add branches on this thing and leaves on the very top so it'll actually look like a tree and not the Eiffel Tower. And so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We made this giant tree structure thing that doesn't look like a tree right now, but it will. 
we made this chest room, we made the crafting room, we made this cactus thing room, and we made the living quarters, which doesn't actually have anything in it, in the chests, but still, we had this little elevator thing that goes all the way down and eventually leads into water, and now I think I'm stuck down here. Um, we found a gnome, um, he wasn't supposed to be in this part of the video, but okay. And of course, we couldn't forget this giant cactus statue. So if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. We're so, so close to 30 subscribers. And then after that, we're going to be aiming for 50. So yeah, I hope you subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.